Hey guys, welcome back to Critic Kid. Today I'm going to be reviewing Jojo Rabbit. So, before we can begin, I just want to say thank you to all my viewers and subscribers because this means a, this channel means a lot to me and they liked it and so they subscribed to it and I just want to say thank you my viewers because they're amazing and subscribers and if you have not subscribed yet please subscribe because our goal is 1000 subscribers by January 20th 2021 that's only like two and a half months away so come on guys we can do it all right now to review so Jojo Rabbit is about this boy who is a who wants to be a Nazi when he grows up and um so he goes to this Nazi camp with a bunch of other kids and his best friend. And then they train to become Nazis. And uh, so they fall asleep that night. And then the next morning, Jojo is the kid's name. So Jojo and his imaginary best friend, Adolf Hitler. So they're off in the woods. And while, while at camp, the other kids are learning how to throw grenades. And so Jojo, Jojo and his best friend Adolf Hitler, his imaginary best friend Adolf Hitler, run up and steal the grenade, and then Jojo throws it, it hits a tree, falls back down, bounces onto him, and then it explodes, and he almost died, but he survives somehow, and then they rush him to the hospital, he gets surgery, he miraculously survives and then the next day he wakes up and his mom's there and then his mom says straighten up Jojo and then they go out and his mom takes him takes Jojo back to the camp for another day and then so after that when Jojo returned home his mother wasn't there and then he walked upstairs looking for his mom his mom wasn't there and then he noticed like a very tiny sliver in the wall and so he used his pocket knife that he got at the nazi camp and cut the door open and it real revealed as a secret wall or secret door excuse me and then he walked there was like this almost like a hallway and at the end of the hallway he saw that his mom was hiding a jew and then he screamed at the top of his lungs ran back out and then uh ran downstairs and then his and then then his the jew that his mom was hiding came and said if you tell your mom that you know that if you tell your mom that you know that i'm here i'm going to cut off your little nazi head which i thought was hilarious and then after that uh his mom came home and they had dinner and then the next day they tried to make a negotiation and then they promised to each other that if the um if that Jojo told his mom that he knew that the Jew was hiding in their house then she would probably kill him and if he, and if she didn't do anything to him, then he wouldn't tell his mom. So, then later that day, he started collecting data about Jews. And he started drawing these pictures. And throughout that day, he wrote letters because the girl, the Jew girl, told him that um, her fiancé, Nathan, served in, or was in the... Uh, resistance which was fighting against the Nazis and um, so he started writing these fake letters telling her that he uh, met this other girl but then he decided to dump her to come back to her and so that was kind of sweet I thought that was pretty sweet I thought and then next stop the next day the um, there's a group of these people who supported Hitler and they came to the door and they came to investigate and then so they came and walked around and uh, then the counselor from the Nazi camp came 
and they investigated the house and then the Jewish girl had when they knocked on the door she had to go hide and then she got dressed and then she um uh, she acted like she was his sister and then she said the she said what the Nazi said but I thought that was the part I kind of I pretty I disliked about this movie but otherwise it was really good and then after that he the next day he went downtown and uh he found out that I'm not gonna tell you because that'll spoil the movie <laughs> and then I'm not gonna spoil the rest of the movie because it's pretty sad but I really thought this was a good movie and so I rated this a 9.7 on the critic or on the CK scale um this was approximately one hour and 47 minutes around there and so this is rated PG-13 so probably not a very good it was rated PG-13 because of the language and so not recommended for smaller children but around my age yes it's it's good for my like kids at my age yes they can watch it so Jojo Rabbit definitely recommend it I really thought this was good so please subscribe and like this video and go watch Jojo Rabbit it is available on HBO Max so if you have HBO Max go watch Jojo Rabbit right now so thank you for watching hit the subscribe button and goodbye.